So, um, first of all, I just wanted to say um, good morning to each and everyone. So, I am Charles Dalam Omonana. So, this video is the continuation of the, the continuation of report of Marshal Raina Masuka, the aftermath of Marshal Marshall Rose Virginia. The psychological warfare began as soon as Embryal and Ramos declared their de detection. In reality, only about 200 fully armed soldiers were at Defense Ministry, including Enril's non-combatant military staff and Gedor's battle-tested troops. A frame, despite Ramos' claim that it was solidly fortified with 2,000 men. The initial account was just 57. During the first 12 hours, the combination of black people powers Marcos, misreading of the realities in the street reversed the odds in the re re rebels' favor. Yet, the potential for disaster is still lurk. lurk. When Marcos presented Morales, Mala 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 Malaheng, Ken, and Aramin on TV, Ram confirm, confirmed they had been found out. And because the president only talked about the Malacanang assault, the reformists could not determine the ex extent of the damage of their initial plan. On Sunday date, Ramos had Enviral and his men moved to his, to his headquarters in Camp Graham across the street from Camp Aguinaldo. Thus, at around noon that day, the, the match photographer photo, photogra, photographed walk across Edsa with the, tr with the trunks forming a protection shield around and rails and the ram, ram leaders marked the beginning of the love fest between civilians and soldiers. Later that day, Malacanang, and got, Malacanang got word that Enviral and Ramos would initiate military action, which had, which was false. So the, mar the so the Marines with their tanks and armor, armored vehicles, vehicles were ordered move to periphery of Camp Aguinaldo as a pre preventive measure. That was when the famous Kodak moments of the miracle of Edja happened, when the soldiers. At uh, top, military tanks were fed, preyed upon, huge and would by the crowd to participate in the making of history. While was while there was no denying the effect of such collective affection on the soldiers' will to fight, their eventually withdrawal was actually ordered by Marcos when he woke up that day. The president thought any military action was unnecessary because he was confidently he could talk Johnny and Eddie out of, out of their madness. That Sunday morning, Marcos was desperately trying to reach and real. He called, he called up his minister, minister of Energy, Jeronimo Velasco, and Riles' close friend and gave him a private di direct line for Enrile to call because it took Enrile a while to cross over to Crane. To Crame. The president had to wait. Velasco says he never found out what the two talk about but his friend Johnny called him up around 2 p.m. and said I think we're going to make it but how how soon can you fly out? And Bill wanted the Velasco to go to the U.S. and meet up with Salas so that both them could go to Washington. DZ, DZ, should Marcus actively start the, rebe the rebellion? Velasco left on the private plane early and next morning, the first flight given clearance out of Manila then. That will be all. Thank you.